So we're looking at um, price action. We're looking at price action. Um, we're wanting it to pretty much come up here, grab these highs. Um, most likely we're gonna see it consolidate, drop first, aggressively push up, and then aggressively push down all at once. Usually when it's consolidating, nothing's about to happen. Usually most of the time, a consolidation doesn't create that big of a move. But like for example, if we look left here, price went up fast, then it drops hard, and then that's the buy up, right? Notice how this time where it's consolidating, it doesn't make a huge move. It moves down a little bit, but once it made a move up first, then it makes the move down. That's what we're looking at right now. Right now, price is up here. It's like in this consolidation zone. If you look to the right, like what's actually happening today. Um, price is just consolidating up here at the top. So we're probably not going to see like an aggressive drop. We're first probably going to see a small drop down somewhere down here, you know, maybe 200. I mean, that's like 200 pips, something like that, 150. So we'll probably see something like this happen where it may consolidate. It's going to drop like that. And then it's going to come up at once like this. Then it's going to drop down. And then it's probably going to make that's going to be the low of the week right here. And then it's going to do this Friday, Friday morning, the, the buy, most likely Friday morning, maybe Thursday morning. It just depends how fast it happens. And so if you look at this potential structure that plays out, we're going to be waiting for this area right here. You see where this pink, that pink zone is. If you look left, we have the liquidity. We have these highs and we have this structure. All right. So look left again. We're going to be looking for this, guys, right here. This is what we want to see. Now, imagine before this big drop happens. You know, you're, you're a typical trader. You're thinking, oh, gold's flying to the moon, right? It makes a really strong push up aggressively, and then that's the high. It stops. Why does it stop right there? And then it drops straight hard. I want you to look left, okay? Look left and notice that this is what a lot of times happens. Okay. If you look left, it moves up aggressively and then that's when it drops. So on the next zoom, we're going to go over this into more detail. Um, anyway, guys, be on the lookout for this and um, be ready, right? Be ready. If you don't know how to get into these trades, make sure you send me a message. Make sure you get your account set up, um, plug into the education and um yeah guys let's get you guys making money um trading and um you know let's get in these trades there's a good chance we're gonna see a sell here and then a buy here um we're not selling here we don't do this wait for the right setup this is we're gonna be looking for a sell and then down here underneath this low which is the low of the week so far the low of the week on monday so anyone that bought on monday they're probably gonna come for those stop losses Right, and then it's gonna move us, make us move up. So the stop losses are right here. Today is Wednesday afternoon. It's Thursday over there in Europe. Um, we're gonna be wanting to see this happen, guys. So this is what I'm looking at tonight and tomorrow morning and for the rest of the week. Um, once it hits this low, that's most likely gonna be the low of the week. And it's most likely gonna turn around at some point. We could see it dip lower than that even, but we'll see what happens. Stay tuned, guys. Uh, moment by moment, and uh, see you guys on the next one.